Hi, this is Dr. Jana, and you are watching video with me. How to write a research paper using the online LaTeX editor that is Overleaf. So nowadays, as you have seen, most of these journals and the conferences, international conferences, they are making it mandatory to submit the paper uh, using this LaTeX. So in this video, we will learn completely how to write a paper using this LaTeX. So before that, let us see what is this LaTeX and why we need to write a paper in LaTeX and how to start all the things. This LaTeX, as it is pronounced as LaTeX, it is a tool for typesetting professional looking documents. Uh, we have the alternate like the Microsoft Word or LibreOffice, which uses, uh, as you see this YCYG, this is the tool which provides users with an interactive page into which they can type, they can edit and also they can apply the various forms of styling. But while you are within this LaTeX, it works very differently. So instead of our document in a, is a plain text, here we use some LaTeX commands to express the desired typeset the results. To produce a visible typeset document, our LaTeX file is processed by a piece of software we called it the Tech Engine which uses the commands embedded in our text file to guide and control the typesetting processes and optimally it convert into a PDF file. Okay. So these are the things. Uh, let us see why we should go for this LaTeX. Uh, it supports for typesetting extremely complex mathematics, tables and technical contents for the physical sciences. Next is it is facilitates uh, for footnotes, cross referencing, management of bibliographics, etc. And this is ease of producing complicated or tedious documents, elements such as indexes, glossaries, table of contents, list of figures, etc. So it is also possible in Word, but here it is very uh, easy and it is very looks like very professional. Then it being very highly customizable for uh, bespoke documents production due to its intrinsic programmability and extensively for thousands of free add-on add packages. So these are the reasons why you are going for these things. Now before you starting, let us understand, you will be using some commands in this LaTeX. So first of all, we define uh, just like the document class. So there are four type of document classes we are having. We can write just the class as document class and article, report, book, paper like that. We can go for all things. Okay. So now we can have a number of global options also, which allows to customize the certain elements in the document. So these are the like, uh, we can use the syntax slash document class, this is the command and here I am selecting article as the document class and here are the options, I can put uh, option 1, 2, 3, what are the options, let us see. See, suppose I want to use it the format A4 paper or letter paper, etc. Then this I can put as an options, like global option. Similarly, the font size I want to is 10 point, 11 point, 12 point. So 11 point comma A4 paper comma uh, I can uh, write it landscape comma one side no title page open write all the things we can use it there. So what is the meaning of all these options let us see. So for the font size you are using the 10 point 11 point 12 point you clearly understand. So sup sup suppose sometimes the abstract we want 9 point bold and we want the content as 12 point or 10 point so all the things we can uh, we can put it there. Then the paper size you can use A4 paper, letter paper like that you can put it. The draft mode also you can put it the draft. So these are all the global options we can put it. So suppose we can go for one column or two column or multiple columns that also you can put, uh, put these are the options there. Then formula specific FL equation and L equations like that this, this also you can put it there. And uh, by default the, the C it will take but we can go for the landscape also using this landscape right. Then single and double sided, so one side or two sided that also you can put it there. Then the title page you can use title page or no title page. So open right and open any, open right means all the time the new topic will start in the right hand side. Uh, that means the left hand side of the book it will not start a new topic, okay that is the thing. Okay we will see all the things in details. Then we are going for this title page, what is this title page? You see when you are writing an article especially like a paper. So no title page, it is the default for that. But uh, that is the no title page. For the title page, it is default for report or book. When you are writing a book, so it is mandatory you have to write the title page and for report also it is mandatory, right. 
now the option title page ends the page after the make title so once you type slash make title that means you open is a new page okay that the remaining we started new page okay so that we can use this equivalent to slash make title clear so we'll take an example where you can see it here now let us have a small thing we start the document class and we take the article here the global options i have not given and use package blind text just i want to because instead of typing i want to put some blind text some random text the title this is an article begin document so if you start the document you have to start with the begin document and the end we put the end these are the uh, different commands in our latex then when you after the begin document in slash make title that means up to this your um, no title name whatever you are writing it will come in one page and the remaining it will come in another page right so then if you want to write some abstract begin slash begin you see you see you are using slash begin and whatever things you are writing in the curly brackets you can see the document article is coming in the curly bracket blind text it is there so begin document document is coming in the curly braces so like that begin abstract something blind text randomly write end abstract and the document what this is also this we can write the abstract similarly suppose in a book uh, or in a report we can have the various uh, sections sub sections like that the chapters we can have it how do you do like that so suppose i want the document class and the class is report here i go for the two side and open right so as i told you the global um, options there then use package blind text this is a package i can use it here just like you no know, library you are using in other program then begin document at the end end document then chapter i ch start a new chapter and i started started the first chapter you can give a name to that one i give it the first chapter uh, then i put some blind text why because the blind text randomly something write i need not write it here because i don't have a content now then i start the second chapter chapter second chapter then i put some blind text and end the document so like this we can go for this uh, suppose i go for anyway these things we, uh, we will be clear once we um, go for our uh, things now let us go for uh, our uh, alertx now uh, let us uh, start a small program where you can clearly see what are the things we are going to do now let us start with our uh, program here so you can see i am using one of the online editor that is overleaf so there is no need to install any software here you just type overleaf in any of the browser then you just uh, create a account there or you can use your google account to log in i used my google account so once you go there so it will ask you to create a new uh, folder so i created a new folder so this folder name i have given something if you can see i have given some test so this is the name i have given just test so then how do you uh, write this program so just i am putting it here control i just make it a little big bigger size because it will be easy for you to understand so now you can see i started with the start document class and here i am writing article and the title page i am using because it is article i am giving it here by default so then use package lipsum so it is just like that you are using a blind text no so you can use this lipsum also using this some random text will be generated then i use the uh, the i want to start the document so slash begin document then i write some title suppose my title should be latex and the author is gunamani jana make title then i st i start the abstract so begin slash begin abstract so lip some one so what are the random text to tell there so once you run this thing so control i put it because this is coming bigger so you cannot see see when you just recompile this one the title here what you have given what is the title you given title given latex and the author name i have given gunamanjana and the date also you have given today's date so it is coming november 21 2023 and here after this i am writing the make title when make title the remaining it will go to the next page you see the next page it is starting i started with you know begin abstract and leave some one some random things lower this some this is the random because i did not type as i am using this package leave some so automatically it is created so then end abstract then i introduce another that is section introduction so you see a new section so uh, now all the section will be creating by default 1 2 3 like that will be created so you can go for section you can go for sub section all things you can create so section introduction here also i am using some uh, lip sum one that means some randomly some text is generated here then i am going for the end of the document right so this is the way how you can start writing and start learning doing things right so next we go for another document i showed the test 2 i show you here here also see just i am going 
to little modify the previous one what i have given uh, here the document class i have given report use package libsum and i am writing author jijana and title i am giving learn latex uh, something like that i have given and uh, then the date today's date i am putting so then renew command uh, these sections that i am putting it there all this is up to this it is the same then begin document and make title it, you can understand these things then begin abstract so that means after this a new abstract page will be created you can see i created a abstract page and here also i am giving some um, because i already using the use package libsum so libsum 6 1 2 3 4 5 6 anything you can put it here so the libsum is randomly this is not any content some randomly it is generated by the system uh, then uh, i want to create a table of content so uh, the abstract you created and the end abstract so you want to create the table of content so in as you know in microsoft word you see a lot of help to create the but here just i'm using slash table con table of contents you see table of contents automatically created for you so introduction page 1 background automatically uh, what are the section sub section um, all the things by the by default highlighted and serially will be there and page number automatically and all this process will be done then i create a section the first section is the introduction first section is introduction so in this introduction uh, you see i am using uh, libsum 1 okay so once you use this libsum 1 sir some randomly some text is generated then i put a subsection that is the background you see after one automatically generated 1.1 background and here also again i am putting some ra random things libsum 2 i am putting it here so it is also created there then i am going for another subsection research gap so 1.2 will be the research gap uh, something it is created there also you can see it here and here also i am putting the content I have some three, some randomly it is written. Uh, similarly, I am going for the subsection literature study. Okay, the literature study sub no no sub sub section it will not take. It is only sub section. Uh, that side it has not taken. Um, sub section it will take. So yeah. So if you compile it here, then this uh, sub section literature study uh, was not there. It is not showing as a thing, but it will now it will compile and 1.3 it will come. Okay. So you see. Uh, literature study research gap 1.3 literature study it has already shown here you can see it here similarly i am going for another section problem identification uh, another section it is coming you see problem identification is coming then suppose i am going for the proposed method or methodology then some objectives and begin uh, so in this objective suppose i want to put some you know suggest items just like now um list you are using ordered list or not a list there so you can also use all the things here so for using this ordered list uh, sorry on ordered list you can use slash begin item size slash begin item size and end item size begin item size end item size in between you can put a number of item so that means with dot all these things it will come uh, where you can check it here in the objectives the first item is to write research paper neatly the objective and to deal all the things it is coming there so similarly if you want to uh, use with the uh, enumerate like one dot something two dot something then write uh, enumerate you can write enumerate um, uh, item and all things you can do that that i will show that is the next one then you go for another section algorithm section result and discussion so all things it will be there and bibliography you want so now you can clearly understand how neatly you can do all the things just you focus on your content and the remaining thing it is taken care by uh, the latex overlap right so this was one of the things uh, the two i have shown then we are going for the test number 3 so this is one uh, test uh, i am go going to do it for you now let us look at these things i am going um, for one more thing here uh, yeah you check it here so i am writing a paper here right so document class something i am writing article and a4 page i am using use package libsum begin document so title something i am writing uh, so it is coming something title here uh, yeah title is coming and author also i am something uh, anything you are write title author and and uh, there then begin the abstract the abstract is coming anyway it is because of some reason it is coming up but it will come there also so recompile it is okay so anyway nothing to worry so this will come so now you the uh, then make title when you make the make the make title here oh, this has to be done uh, after begin document make title that is the reason it is showing okay uh, control x uh, 
बिगिन डॉक्यूमेंट एंटर कंट्रोल भी यहाँ में एक टाइटल रिकम्पाइल कैन सी दिस थिंग यू कैन टेक इट या अप टू दिस यू कैन फिनिश या इट आई नो इस विदर यू यू कैन मेक ऑल द थिंग्स यू कैन मॉडिफाई ऑल द थिंग्स देन एब्सट्रैक्ट यू कैन क्रिएट द एब्सट्रैक्ट हियर एंड समथिंग यू पुट इट देयर देन यू कैन क्रिएट अ नंबर ऑफ सेक्शन सेक्शन वन इंट्रोडक्शन सेक्शन टू बैकग्राउंड ऑल द थिंग्स यू कैन पुट इट देयर देन प्रीवियसली आई हैव गिवन द बिगिन आइटम साइज दैट इज द थिंग्स दैट इज द अनऑर्डर लिस्ट सपोज यू गो फॉर द ऑर्डर लिस्ट सो बिगिन एनुमरेट एंड एंड एनुमरेट सो द सेम आइटम इट विल कम इन वन डॉट टू डॉट लाइक दैट यू कैन सी हियर इज वन डॉट समथिंग हियर इज टू डॉट समथिंग हियर इज थ्री डॉट समथिंग ऑल द थिंग्स यू कैन सी इट हियर राइट सो इन दिस वे ऑल द थिंग्स विल बी यूजिंग फॉर आवर थिंग्स राइट सो नाउ लेट अस गो फॉर द वन मोर एग्जाम्पल हर यू कैन सी ऑल थिंग्स ऑल टूगेदर सो नाउ आई एम गोइंग फॉर द टेस्ट फोर द टेस्ट फोर यू सी यू कैन सी जस्ट लाइक ए कम्प्लीट पेपर हाउ हाउ यू कैन डू ऑल थिंग्स सो आई यूज द डॉक्यूमेंट क्लास एंड द ग्लोबल ऑप्शन आई पुट ए फोर पेपर एंड हियर इट इज द आर्टिकल यू कैन क्लियरली सी दिस द माइंड डॉक्यूमेंट क्लास देन यूज पैकेज समथिंग आई एम इनपुट ई एन सी देन यूज पैकेज ग्राफिक्स बिकॉज आई वॉन्ट टू यूज सम पिक्चर्स और ग्राफ्स देन यूज पैकेज लिप्सम बिकॉज आई वॉन्ट टू यूज सम रैंडम टेक्स्ट आई एम नॉट राइटिंग एनीथिंग सो ऑल थिंग्स एव रिटिन यूज पैकेज एम एस दर इज अमेरिकन मैथमेटिकल सोसाइट मैथ एम एस फंड्स एम एस सिम्बल्स यूज पैकेजेस ग्राफिक्स ग्राफिक्स एनी एनी ऑलरेडी टू एज देर सो इट इज रिपीटेड यू कैन रिमूव दैट वन दिस इज नॉट नेसेसरी बिकॉज टू टाइम्स नॉट नेसेसरी सो डिलीट डिलीट दिस वन ऑल्सो सो ग्राफिक्स इज देर देन पेज नंबर ऑल्सो देर पेज नंबर इज देर ऑल्सो यूज पैकेज सो ऑल द थिंग्स यू यू ऑल द थिंग्स यू पुट इट हियर देन सपोज प्रीवियसली द की वर्ड वॉज नॉट कमिंग सो दिस दिस परसेंटेज साइन इट इज जस्ट फॉर राइटिंग द कमांड्स हाउ टू इनसर्ट सो आई प्रोवाइड कमांड इन द कॉली ब्रैकेट स्लाश की वर्ड एंड वेन आई एम यूजिंग वन द की वर्ड इट विल कम देर ना आई एम यूजिंग इन द कॉली ब्रेस इज स्मॉल दैट मीन्स यू कैन सी द की वर्ड इट इज कमिंग स्मॉल टेक्स्ट बोल्ड फंड बोल्ड बोल्ड फंड सो यू सी इट इज कमिंग बोल्ड एंड स्लास टेक्स्ट इटालिक व्हाट इज दैट द की वर्ड्स ओके सो दिस की वर्ड्स इट इज कमिंग द बोल्ड फंड एंड ऑल्सो इटालिक लेटर सो दिस इज वन व्हाट इज द वन यू हैव गिवन इन सो दिस इज द की वर्ड एंड दे आर व्हाट आर द की वर्ड्स विल बी राइटिंग दोज थिंग्स इट विल कम देर अफ यर अफ दैंक सो देन आई एम राइटिंग द टाइटल सम टाइटल लेटर्स लर्न लाटेक प्रोफेसनाली द टाइटल इज कमिंग यर अथर नेम गुणामणि जेना सो टू अथर आई एम पुटिंग गुणामणि जेना सर सुभाषिष जेना समथिंग लाइक दैट देन सिमिलरली आई एम पुटिंग द डेजिनेसन ओके सो आई एम रईटिंग स्मल सी कैन यू सी फर रईटिंग द इक्वेसन सु विल बी यूजिंग नो डलार सैन एंड इनसाइड द डलार सैन ह्वाट एवर थिंग्स आर रईटिंग बै थिंग्स डूंग बट आई वांट रईट दिस वन इट सुड बी नो ऑन दि टप नो व्हाट यू आर टेलींग द इन इन वार्ड यू आर यूजिंग नो सो दिस थिंग्स वी कैन पुट इट हियर सो यू कैन सीट हियर दिस प्रोफेसर इट इज कमिंग वन प्रोफेसर सी एस सी टू रिसर्च स्कलर गुणामणि जेना वन सुभाषिष जेना टू दैट इज फास्ट अथर सेकेंड अथर फास्ट एजुनेसन सेकेंड एजुनेसन फास्ट अर्गानाइजेसन सेकेंड अर्गानाइजेसन फास्ट इमेल आई डी सेकेंड फर दैट पर्पज वी कैन यूज इट दर रईट सो देन सिमिलरली देन अथर नेम फास्ट अथर हाउ आउ डू रईट सो अथर देन यू रईट द गुणामण जेना बै डिफल्ट इट विल देर बट उथ गुणामण जेना आई वांट टू रईट द फास्ट अथर सो डलार सैन डलार सैन एंड ए क्या इन सैड द कलिब्रेस एस आई रेट दैट मीन्स गुणामण जेना इज द फास्ट अथर देन सुभाषिष जेना डलार सैन क्या कलिब्रेस टू इज द सेकेंड अथर एगेन यू अंडरस्टाण द स्मल इज फर स्मल बिग इज फर बिग ह्यूज इज फर ह्यूज अल दिस कमांड्स अल्सो यू एंड चेक यू अल्सो सो यू कैन रईट द प्रोफेसर यू कैन रईट द रिसर्च कलर सो दिस इज द अर्गानाइजेसन आई रईट इट इज एगेन द बीबीसी इंजीनियरी कलेज और समथिंग लाइक दैट द आई आई टी पटना एंड इमेल आई डी आई कैन पुट इट डक्टर जी जेना एट दैंड सम जेना लाइक दैट लाइक दैट डूट सो दैन डेट टू डेज डेट यू कैन पुट इट दर अल थिंग्स इट इज कमिंग सो रईट देन देन बिकज यू विल बी यूंग सम ग्राफिक्स अलरेडी यूज पैकेज ग्राफिक्स 
and we will be putting everything inside one folder images because you create a folder uh, how to create a folder you can see here new file and new folder so once you click it here uh, one interface should will come you write the name of the folder i write the images you can write lower case i or upper case i whatever things you write remember so this folder all the time you did not uh, show the folder so you write the graphics path in the curly braces uh, what is that path you put that images and the forward slash right mm, okay then then begin the document make title that means up to this it is okay then begin the abstract so abstract started here what i am writing uh, in the abstract uh, i am writing a little some uh, one so some some document it is created there then ignore then i am writing keyword because for writing the keyword already i created the previously so i am writing keywords suppose i am writing the, the support vector machine the decision tree random forest something something i am writing you see how neatly uh, these things are written just like as if a good paper it is coming okay fine then i go for the section one section is created one introduction i am putting the lipsum to uh, some text is randomly created there then i am going for this uh, section another section that is the background so back to the background section you can see it here in this section i want to insert an image it is my image you can see it here how do you insert this image first to take it so before inserting the image the image you have to create or download or copy or whatever things are there and you put it inside the folder where is the folder my folder is images folder so you created then you drag and drop it here or you click it here upload so by clicking this image folder you click it here so that you select that uh, file you can put it jpg file you can put it png file whatever the files I, I put the jpg file you put it there so now which one i am going to do i am going to put this figure gjana.jpg you remember that one so this i put it here inside the images folder and already the path i have given so here what simply i have done i am showing you so include graphics you see slash include graphics in the background the background slash include graphics width i am putting four you can make it four six the size will be increasing then which file you want to put it the gjana.jpg which is already in the images just i am writing in the curly braces gjana.jpg caption what should be written below that one it should be written an image of gjana so it is an image of gjana and label figure so this by default the figure one figure two it will be created okay so this is the thing so end figure so what is the uh, figure you created so figure ending also it is done here now end figure is there begin figure started where begin figure is here oh, you got it now so um, back it begin figure is there and the centering is because begin figure first to uh, start it there first then you write the centering because the by default the figure will come the left hand side so you want centering or left or right you can put it that thing so all the things that end figure is there then again i am going for another section uh, that is the technology gap okay so here right is something like that no um, some lipsum four then another subsection under this section i am creating another subsection that is the literature survey that means under section three when I created a subsection, it is coming 3.1. Like that subsection, subsection, you can put it there. Here I am trying to do some mathematical equations, okay, in this literature survey. In the literature survey, you can see, uh, leave some 8, it is okay. Then for beginning the mathematics, there are so many options, but we start with the uh, begin math. And when you begin the math, then you slash sq it and in the curly braces, whatever things you put, you can put it here. So I put it, this is the, then, uh, so... Uh, x square plus 1 square root of x square plus 1 so it is coming square root of x square 1 okay another method is that you can put it so that is the slash in the square bracket braces because you are using begin math and all things but here what i am telling i am telling you that slash uh, square bracket s square it same thing i am writing it here and then it is also coming the same result it is showing another way of doing that uh, you can use it like begin display math square root of something and display math it is also same thing it is coming okay so um, even if uh, for another way there also uh, begin equations with star mark you can put it here and all the square root and an equation so all the things is there you can go for another section uh, proposed model so the proposed model and section i am leave some for i am putting uh, then i am going for the algorithm uh, new section leave some uh, here I want to put no I told you that I want to the list so for using list I use the item size 
and end item size okay begin item size and end item size it is there then for enumerate also begin enumerate and end enumerate you know what is the difference between these things so for the item uh, size it will come dot 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 enumerate one two three like that like that it will come okay so then and enumerator then subsection dysentery uh, and all the things result discover and all the things you can put it here and one more thing i want to show you i want to uh, tell you how to write a, a table how to create a table so for creating table you need to use the begin table okay and here the square bracket this is all the things then it is the center the table i want to create in the center then begin tabular uh, see uh, the the different columns uh, if you want to uh, put it the vertical lines then you have to put this vertical lines here okay suppose i start two vertical lines uh, beginning and the end two vertical you can see here also two vertical lines here two vertical if you want to put a vertical line here you can put a vertical line you can put a vertical line you can put a vertical line here but i don't want a vertical line in between so only uh, the borders only i put the vertical lines and double i want i put it double so h line uh, the first one uh, i put a h line so first you can see horizontal line is created then after that i am writing what are the data items column 1 and column 2 and column 3 and column 4 so and i put a space of 0.5 okay then i put h line h line twice you see uh, two times lines are coming then all the data one and six and all things and even separate separated by the double line so you can see all the data is entered okay then finally the h line last the horizontal line is done here then n tabular n tabular means started the uh, begin tabular it is n tabular so table is completed so you can write a caption uh, caption name of the table this is an uh, this is the caption for the first table so writing this is the caption for the first table okay so um, then you can give the label label table 1 so it is coming table 1 table 2 by default all the things it will come so end table uh, then you go for the section uh, conclusion so up to this it is fine and uh, now one important things i want to tell you how to write the bibliography bibliography it is simple the references how to write that one that also i'll say you so here uh, begin the bibliography i'm writing you see slash begin the bibliography then uh, you, you can put the bb items the bb item then what are the things you uh, the about the what is the name of the authors and the year colon what is the title of the things and uh, which uh, magazine and what is the year what is the page number all the things you can put it there then you started uh, um, the bibliography begin with the bibliography end the bibliography in between suppose i have taken only one bib item you want to put more number bib items you put a number of bib items right okay so these are the things it is coming and the word count also finally it will come but it is showing some error here so it will come i think some package i forgot there so everything you can do it here because sometimes they want i i think i hope you understand all things now what we have done we have uh, without using any template we learned how to write a research paper using the online latex editor that is the overleaf so if you like this video uh, please do share with your friends and uh, put a like also there and also if you have any doubt and queries and you can comment and you can put your views also um, thank you for watching this video uh, in your next part we'll go in uh, for a, a detailed video uh, detailed video and it will start from the scratch it was just uh, a scratch uh, I have given to you the people who are immediately going for writing research papers, especially uh, the MTech people and also the PhD scholars. So for them, this will be a very nice platform. Thank you once again for watching this video. Have a good day.